After visiting the most isolated place in Nigeria, we decided to visit another mind-blowing place. <laughs> How was it? How was it? How was it easy? Have you ever seen have you ever seen a mountain as big as this one? Not really, no. Everything in this town will shock you from their way of survival to their way of living. They live in harmony in this town. It is crazy that in a family you'll find different people with different religions under the same roof. They drink from the same cup and eat from the same pot. Fortunately, they don't have good source of water. Majority of them in this town are farmers, while the rest are merchants, mostly youths. This watermelon? Yes. They just harvested this watermelon and they are going to sell it. It is very cheap in this town. If you like this video, don't forget to like, subscribe and turn on notification. This is how they get water they used to cook and drink in this town. This place is island. Their land is fertile. You don't need to dig up to 6 inches. Water will start rushing out. As you can see, he's digging up the ground and water is rushing out. This water at the moment is not clean. But he's going to turn this water to a better water that they will use to cook and also to consume. As you can see, the water is now clean and the people of this town can now drink it or use it to cook. Let's check it out. It's now clean. It's right now. It's so cold. After this step, the next step is to look for something to cover it. It will now look like a well, just like this. Everybody in this town come here to fetch water. This is their own source of water. In this town, they have no borehole or proper well. Now everybody comes here to fetch water. They have no any other source of water than this one. In this town, they have two different religions here, Christianity and Islam. There is no history of violence. They live in harmony in this town. Many people come to this town to buy farm produce because it is very cheap in this town. The general spoken language in this town is Hausa, but they all have their own language, Kanakuru and Lala. The name of this town is Shelly and it is located in northern Nigeria, Adamawa State. Thank you for watching this wonderful video. For more videos like this, kindly follow us, subscribe and share this video. I'll see you guys for the next one.